What's up guys, Spawn64 here and welcome back to another how-to. I recently did one showing how to get night mode tweak on a jailbroken iPhone, iPad, iPod running 9.3, iOS 7, iOS 8, all that. For now it's not on iOS 10 so if you're behind or can't update or don't want to update, go back to this, make sure your phone is jailbroken with the Cydia app right here and you can download the Eclipse thing and you can see the rest of the details in the video. Anyways, in this video, today I'll be showing you how to get 3D Touch on an older device. So like an iPhone 6, iPhone 5, uh, iPhone SE, iPad, iPods. So as you can as you can tell, I have an iPhone 6. I don't know if it's like obvious to you guys. I guess like screen-wise, it looks like the 6S, but trust me, if I had the 6S, I wouldn't need to be showing off this tweak. And it would be pointless and it would just mess it up. So you do need a custom source and it is called Createx. The repo is, H I'll, I'll, you can either pause it here and type it in or I'll leave a link in the description. But anyways, you, with the Createx thing, you let it install and you would get Peekaboo right here. There is a problem when you download it. If you search it without having this file or without that source, other peekaboo tweaks will come up so like this one for example will come up and this one does not work it says compatible but it does not work I've tested it on other ones you need to have the one from Createx and it'll have this little green square that'll come up and so as you can tell you 3d touch and you can have these tweaks like so not every app works and but when they do they have certain stuff that even iPhone 6s's don't have. If I didn't have th this um, dock on the bottom, I could do it on these tweaks. I mean, on these apps. Oh, let me not open that. So, so like phone, Twitch doesn't, Snapchat. Guys, they have so many integrated stuff with this. It's crazy, and it lags a little bit because I'm recording right now. But trust me, when I'm not recording, there's no lag at all. There's been, it's been so nice, but let me show you the settings I have it on because I know if you don't, it's really sensitive with the force touch. So have the sensitivity around 80 or higher. If it's lower than that, that means anything you touch, it'll just like spaz out and it'll like, it'll look, it'll either do that or it'll blur and just get really weird and it'll crash. So have it 80 so it you can feel the sensitivity somewhat. You can change your haptic feedback on peak pop, enable it for messages. But thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoy this quick tweak. This also works on like the internet and stuff too, guys. In other places. So like you can 3D touch on website and it'll open Kiss Anime, for example. There you go. It'll work with messages, photos. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoy this quick little tweak. Not trying to have a long video for something I could explain super fast. A peekaboo by the Createx team source. They also have some other cool tweaks. Go check them out. They're amazing. Thank you all for watching. And that's it. Bye.